Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'll be showing you the best um, Valorant settings for FPS. Um, these results were tested by some other YouTubers that I found. Not just one, so, I, so I'll put the YouTubers benchmarks in the description below to get videos. So, let's go to video. And let's start general. Display mode, you should always put on full screen. If you put on window full screen or window, it will decrease your FPS by a lot. Resolution, you should put it to the highest, which is your native resolution, with the highest refresh rate, which is your monitor's refresh rate. You should put it there. It's not worth sacrificing quality for for more FPS because you can't see people from like a far distance away, which are like somewhere around there. If you want 720p, you, will, you can't really see them. And aspect ratio, I mean monitor, put it to your main monitor, of course. Aspect ratio method, put it to fill. And limit FPS on battery, turn that off. Limit FPS in menus, turn that off. Max FPS in menus, uh, limit FPS in background, turn that off. Limit FPS always, turn that off. NVIDIA reflex low t latency, this one depends if you have a NVIDIA GPU. If you do have, turn it on to on plus boost. And that's it for general tab. Let's go graphics quality. And the first thing, multi-threaded rendering. You should put it on if you have more than four cores on your PC. Um, to check, you can go to your task manager and it will say how many cores you have. Material quality, turn that to low. Texture quality, put that to medium. Um, there's not any, like, there's no difference between medium and low, so... Just put it on medium so you can see more. Detail quality, same same explanation, not much different. Put it on medium. UI quality, um, this one just makes your like when you open your menu tab, you can see the background here is kind of dark. If you put it to medium, you can see um more transparent. If you put it to high, it will have a blur effect. So I recommend you put it on medium to make it sharp and you can see stuff. Vignette, you should turn that off. It it will make your aim like you can't see as much with Vignette on. V sync, turn it off. Unless you get like a lot of screen tearing. Anti aliasing, there's not much different between these three, so I recommend you put it on MSAA four X. Ensotrophic filtering, turn that to four times uh, or four X. Improved clarity, turn that off. Beta, experimental sharpening, turn that off. You don't want sharpening, it will decrease your FPS. Bloom, this one, if you turn it on, you will decrease FPS, but, like, um, okay, if your gun has skins, which I don't have, I'm very poor, if you have, like, those glowing skins, it will pop out more color. It will have, like, a bloom effect around it, which, which is not, which makes your games look better, but it will decrease your FPS by a bit. Distortion, turn that off. First person shadows, also turn that off. And that's about it for graphics quality tab. And let's go to stats. Um, I would recommend you turn on client FPS, total frame time, and packet loss. These are, these are the ones that you need and the most useful ones to, to see. Client FPS, you put it text only, you can see on the top right, I mean top left, you can see the client FPS, which is the FPS I'm getting right now. And total frame time, text only, you can see on the top left as well, right beside your client FPS, total frame time. And packet loss, um, if your internet's bad, you can see that if it's bad or not, and if you're getting packet loss, you can see on the top left. And yeah, that's about it for the video tab. These are one of the best settings to to put on your Valorant to get the most FPS. And yeah, that's about it. See you guys. See you guys in the next one.